Tom. A Sherman man has drowned at the Turner Falls swimming area over the weekend. But on the Kayamichi River, recovery efforts are still ongoing, searching for two brothers who went missing Saturday night. News 12's Jeremy Thomas has been following both of these stories and brings us the latest. It's sad. A 32-year-old Sherman man was out swimming with friends in the Falls swimming area. But around 1:15, Turner Falls personnel received a call that he had went under and never resurfaced. Authorities weren't able to locate him. An OHP dive team was called in and located his body under eight feet of water around 6.30. Davis police, fire, and Murray County EMS assisted on scene. Orly Luezo was with family when she heard emergency sirens. We were out swimming by the waterfall and we got out, started hiking up the trail to the top of the waterfall, looked over and that's when paramedics and fire department police and everybody started coming, dive team started getting in and looking for the gentleman. Davis Police Chief Dan Cooper says high water pressure from the falls and panic may have led to the drowning. But Cooper says the drowning is still under investigation. No other injuries were reported. It's not really scary at the time, but it's sad. The man's body has been sent to Oklahoma City for an autopsy. I just wish she was here, both of them. And we all have been searching all day and just waiting. Waiting and hoping to see her brothers again. Both last seen Saturday night in the Dry Creek area of the Kayamichi River near Albion and Pushmataha County. OHP says it happened after 7.15 p.m. Family has identified the men as 22-year-old Dustin Penisiak and 17-year-old Danny Penisiak. They went swimming and they couldn't swim, but their girlfriend could. Georgia Penisiak Kirkus is the boy's sister. She says authorities told the family a strong current pulled her younger brother down and her older brother jumped in to save him. We've probably been out here longer than anyone here today. And yesterday, haven't we? Except your I mean, mother. I've, yeah, my mother slept here on the, on the side of the highway all night long, and no one stayed with her. We went home, we changed, we came back. Various departments across Pushmataha County assisted, but the family is still asking for your help. We just like people to pray and just check if you live near the river. Just go out there and, and check and see because we need people to look. Authorities will continue their search at daylight with additional personnel and vessels. Just help us bring them home. Just just help us. In Pushmataha County, Jeremy Thomas, News 12.